Well, I wanted to pick an issue that was important to me and my family, so I picked um, focusing on the Windrush. Um, yeah, because we had the Windrush scandal recently, which left um, loads of Caribbeans feeling very mistreated and underappreciated by the government. Um, so I thought I would create a project to kind of raise awareness for the contributions of the Caribbean generation. So um, my campaign is called Home Wasn't Built in a Day. And it's based on my research that last year the government passed through um, an official National Windrush Day. Um, so this year is the first official one, but there's been no publicity for it at all. So I thought I'd create a campaign which kind of raises publicity. Um, so yeah, it's Home Wasn't Built in a Day, celebrating National Windrush Day. Well, one of the first things I did was I interviewed my family. Um, so I shot videos of them, finding out more about their background, things I hadn't learnt before from them, and kind of why they think it's important to celebrate National Windrush Day. So some of these images are actually of my family. So I've got my granddad here, and he told me that he came here with two pairs of shoes, um, with one of the soles off, so <laughs> I thought I'd include that. I've um, got my Uncle Kenneth in it, and then I've also got my Uncle Herman, and I've kind of featured quotes that they've said. And then the other part basically features kind of important facts to make the UK think where would Britain be without the Windrush generation. So I featured um, one of the first black nurses from Luton, Ola Grant. And then I've got um, one of the first um, radio presenters to play reggae in the UK. I tried to use things that could relate to kind of all of the UK to kind of recognise how the Caribbean communities con contributed to here. And this kind of no, no, no format was inspired by um, the no dogs, no blacks, no Irish posters who my granddad said he remembered seeing here when he arrived and that it was pretty unwelcoming. So I thought I would take that to kind of show things that we might not have without the Windrush generation. I really love kind of protest styles and I think coming from a background of Jamaican, British and Scottish, kind of cultural influence is really relevant in my design work. So that's kind of something I always like to bring in to projects. Um, and kind of diversity is a big issue in the industry at the moment. So yeah, I definitely want to make work that can kind of increase diversity and raise awareness in the industry.